Hello everyone, and welcome to my very first episode in my Amnesia the Bunker playthrough. Yes, Spooktober is still in full swing on the channel, and I believe this is the last game I had lined up as my spooky games for this year. Now, it's been a long time ago when I tried to play through Amnesia the Dark Descent, and I actually was really enjoying the game, but I did not finish it because I have an extremely low tolerance for human-on-human -human torture. I say human-on-human -human because, you know, I don't necessarily mind creatures, I don't mind aliens, robots, stuff like that. It doesn't bother me. But once you start mixing humans, torturing humans, oh, I have like no tolerance for that. Bottle it up quite a bit later though, I played through a game called Soma, which I believe was made by these same developers, and it was fantastic, super terrifying. I really had to push to get through it, but it turned out to be one of my favorite games I played last year. So I'm like, Super excited, super nervous, not quite sure what to expect with this Amnesia the Bunker. I don't know anything about it except for the fact that it's made by those same people. And there's a member of the channel who actually bought this game for me. Thank you so much for gifting it to me. The reason they bought it for me is because they couldn't finish it, but they want to see the whole game. So they bought it for me so I could play it. So thank you. <laughs> Either way, if this by some chance is your first time finding my channel, welcome. Hope you have a fantastic time. And if you do have a really good time, it sure would help me out if you consider hitting that subscribe button. All right, I don't know what I'm getting into with this, but if you guys could be kind enough to leave me encouraging comments in the videos along this playthrough, it was a huge help in Soma. I'm probably going to need it in this one too. All right, here we go. I got to say, just from the loading screen, obviously something's happened here. I have no idea what we're looking at. It's probably hinting at something that'll be revealed in the game. That seems to be typically how these things go. But was something boring out or in? Was somebody trapped in here and they dug their way out? I don't know. I'm very curious about this. <sighs> okay, let's do this. Normal, a horror experience where dying is part of the thrill. It's vital to adapt, use caution, and strategize to survive. Absolutely. Oh, uh, oh my gosh. Okay, yeah, we'll leave all those since they have them checked by default. To survive this war, you'll need two things. First, a basic set of skills. Second, the good God cursed sense to do whatever's necessary. I can teach you the first, the second is up to you. Remain deeply. Oh man. Yo, this looks good. This looks so good. Oh boy. Okay. Uh, hold on. I got some screen tearing. Hold on, just a second. Okay. I think we fixed it up. I turned on the V sync. So, obviously, got a war going on here. Uh, press R to bring out and put away gun. Oh, I got a weapon. <gasps> Yo, I get a weapon in this game. Oh, that's different than the others already. I had no way to defend myself. Of course, maybe, maybe it's a false sense of security. Who knows? Uh, okay, so, and then can I... Oh, cool. I can throw with it. Oh, man. <laughs> we got right into it here, didn't we? Uh, okay, everything's looking good on OBS. Here at the beginning, I'll probably do a lot of looking over there just to check. But, uh, yeah, it looks like it's doing okay. It's like I'm scared to run. Q to lean left and right. Okay. You can I can I grab and swing the handle too or the shovel too? Fire, fire! It says. Hold shift while moving to run. Okay. <gasps> Dude lost his head. Okay, to open doors, then move the mouse. Oh, it swings in. Why is the handle to, why is it a pull handle if it swings in? Okay, to open and close containers. Oh, I could open these two. 
Wait a second. No, I don't want to fire at it. Uh, oh, here we go. Okay, I'm starting to get that there. I hope I'm not on like some kind of a timer. <laughs> Something's going to come in here and get me here in a minute. Oh, that's something. Old R to reload. I didn't realize that was ammo. I was just grabbing it to <laughs> play around with it. Am I still reloading the gun? Uh, it looks like it's empty. Oh, I have to hold the R button. I see. Uh, one bullet per box? What? Oh, come on. I mean, I guess considering I used to get no weapon or ammo, I should probably be grateful, right? <laughs> Can I draw a card? Oh, come on. This place is falling apart. What happens if... Oh, I can't... I don't want to use one of my three bullets. Can I swing, like, melee or anything? I mm, guess not. Okay. Yo, gigantic tank right there. Okay, I'm shutting it. Maybe. Maybe it's... Oh, I hear bullets. What is this? Press for longer to go further. Oh, I see. Oh, wow. I'm going to use this to open. How long can I hold it down? Dang, I straight up broke the door. Oh my goodness. Is it safe? I don't know where I'm going. Talk about being thrown just in the mess of it all. It's like I kind of feel a little bit like I'm playing a Call of Duty. Can I squat? Is C crouch? Yo, I pressed C and I put my gun away. Aha, here we go. Control. Move these. Yo, this is crazy. Wow, even when crouched, I can still lean. Oh, I don't have to hold the crouch button. I can tap. Oh, that is so much better. Hello. Grab. There we go. Now, is I feel like I should be able to open this. I thought it was saying I could, like... Okay, let's, let's scoot you off. No, nope, it's just pushing. Huh. <laughs> oh, it's so hard not to shoot this stuff to see if I can break it. Maybe find something inside, but... I only got four ammo. In fact, I got one more bullet. Let's, uh... Let's get her in there. <laughs> it's kind of cool how you love that. Oh, boy! Oh, run. Run, run, run. Oh, boy. Do I just get... Does my health come back if I wait? It's not looking like it. Then you shoot these guys. Oh, somebody else took him out. Lambert. I'll keep... It's so hard to hear him. 
I'm so glad there's captions down there, but they're kind of hard to read, actually. Dude, I am hurting. No, you go away. I don't want to accidentally use you. What are we looking for? Excuse me. Ooh. Oh, I got to jump. Well, that's nice to know. Can I pick any ammo up off these guys? You've been injured. Hold tab to see how bad it is. Uh. Okay. I see how bad it is. What do I do about it? How do I heal <laughs> my injury? Okay, I got a peek. Nope, I don't see anything over there. We must need to go in here. Oh, can I lock it? <gasps> yeah, baby. Although I hope I didn't just like trap myself. Oh! Oh, I was not ready for that. Cloth. You can pick up an item that could be used to crafting. Picking up other cloths, pieces, and press tab to access your inventory page. And combine two cloths to craft bandages. Oh, nice. So here's my inventory page. How do I... Drag them on. Oh, there we go. There we go. Drop hotkeys. One, two, three, four. When equipped, hold the right mouse button and press the left to use. For use on small wounds, capable of getting a soldier back on their feet, even if not fully recovered. Okay, hold this down. Oh my gosh, that's so cool! That is amazing. So now what happens if I... <laughs> I'm in tip-top shape. <laughs> that's amazing. Okay, hold on just a second. I'm going to check and make sure everything's recording real quick. Okay, thankfully everything looks like it's recording just fine. I was a little nervous because I glanced over here and it looked like it was lagging or something, but nope, it, everything looks fine in the recording. I was getting nervous when I first start a game, especially if it's a newer game. This came out, what, about a year ago now? I feel like it was about a year ago when I was hearing about this one. Oh, baby, we got grenades now, too. Do I need to combine these by any chance? A grenade after arming will explode in a matter of seconds. X to drop. Can I equip this? I wonder... What are these other two slots here? Can I put it in that? No. I can put it on a hotkey? Is that... Oh, there we go. Now, if I pull it out, does it automatically pull the pin? No, thank goodness. Oh boy. <laughs> I feel like somebody's getting close. So I can't wear this like for extra armor or anything. Which way does it swing? In or out? Let's try standing up. Wow, this ain't moving. Do I need to break it? This isn't very heavy, though. Oh my god! <laughs> Did you see? It's like the door fought back. It's like, no! <laughs> that was crazy! Well, why can't I open you? That's really weird. Maybe I am supposed to try to break it with something. Mm. 
You stupid door. I need you to open. It won't go either way. Okay, maybe I go back out the way I came in. Let's see. Whoop. Anything change out here? And that big explosion. Nope, nothing changed here. My goodness, it does feel like it's getting darker though, doesn't it? Oh, did it just glitch? It won't open either way. I'm like trying to swing it in or out. It's like something's <laughs> something's blocking it from the other side. And I don't see anything in here heavy enough to... Oh, I wonder if I gotta use my grenade. Maybe they'll give me a chance to to try that. Okay, let's try it. Oh! <laughs> yep! That's why they gave me two also, so I could use one and uh, still have one in my inventory. That was crazy. Is our buddy still up there taking people out? I got this gun, but I'm like seriously trying not to use any bullets. I'm assuming there's some kind of a creature in this because the uh, artwork for like on the logo and stuff kind of made it look like there was maybe a creature. I don't know. Like I said, I haven't seen any gameplay or anything on this. Yo, did you see the blood start running down this? That's crazy. But, uh... If there is, I'm trying to save every bullet I got for that little ordeal. Anything else? Can I grab this, turn it into cloths? That would be nice. Alright, let's get that bullet in there. I'm almost up to a full... Full, uh, round. Whoa! Sound like it was right behind me. <laughs> Dang, this is dangerous. Oh, we got TNT. And boom! That was impressive. I didn't want to use the bullet, but it was impressive. Oh, we're dropping down. A lot of helmets. Oh. Okay. Oh, something went down there. I think that's a grenade. I think that's another grenade. And another one. Oh, it's gas. Okay. Oh, crap. I'm over here. I'm over here. Oh, what do I do? Fast, fast. Oh, thank goodness. We make it out of this come together. You follow me. We're nearly there. Oh man. I thought I I thought I messed up, made a mistake or something. Lambert man. <laughs> Beat that roll, my friend. There you have it, huh? Ah fate's a bastard. I'm on patrol tonight then. C'est la vie. Is that like a flashback? Flash forward? Current event? They were awfully joyous given the situation they're in currently. Yo, check that out. That looks amazing. Am I... Am I in the same place or am I like dreaming or something now? This looks really weird. Check out these trees. Oh, man. 
I'm getting chill. My body's getting chills all over it just because of this setting that we're in. Oh, this is crazy. Perfect game to be playing right around Halloween, right? Oh. What have we here? Is this what we were trying to get to? Maybe. That doesn't sound good. Get you out of here. So we're Henry. <gasps> what are with these little blurry moments? He looks he looks young. I'll get you back to safety. Just hold on to me. Seriously? Can I pull up my gun? Nope. Okay. What happens if I look <laughs> while I got him over my shoulder? Did he fall? Maybe that's what happened. The ground gave way. Oh, I can sprint, though. Man, how far are we going to have to carry this guy to get back to safety? Oh, crap. Run. Oh, run. Oh, crap. Oh, that's the end of him. Did I do that wrong? You are now on your own. Learn, adapt, experiment, and survive. Was I supposed to be on my own, though? That's what I'm trying to figure out. Was it scripted? Or did I make a mistake? Ooh, sounds like a lot of people may be in pain here. We are in a little medical place. That's what I was wondering. Yo, this is crazy. Do I still have... I don't have my, gr my grenade or my gun. Oh, come on. I had a bunch of bullets I had deliberately saved. Uh... Press and hold T, and then move the mouse to rotate it. Oh, nice. I'm glad I can do that, but can I open it? Maybe if I smash it to the wall. Give it bust open with supplies. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Wait. Oh, I got a bunch of junk. A bunch of broken boards. I was hoping to find some bandages or something inside. Is that medical? Oh, What a ripoff. Oh, I don't think that went well. I'm gonna look here. T. That's gonna take some getting used to. Oh, so the wheel zooms it in and out. Okay, I see. Well, that's an interesting look at book. I could turn it off. Can I bring it with me though? <laughs> I think I like the idea of that more. Look, there's like a cross hanging up there and everything. It's so dark in here. I 
I want to bust this where I got some light to work with. I'm surprised that those say medical on them and then there's like nothing on the inside. What else can bust open though? Hmm. Yo, it is so dark. Oh, brace yourself, Ben. Brace yourself. This game is probably going to mess with you. Progress saved. Oh, that was nice of you. I made it through the door. Like, save progress. Okay, all notes that you pick up can be found under the notes tab of your inventory. You can go directly to the picked up note by pressing tab while the icon is flashing. I'm so glad it pauses while the hints come up. I love that. Author? Oh, you can sort by author or date. Ooh, I bet as I get more of these, I might want to sort by date so I can see them in like an order. July 10th, 1916. Soul date Clement admitted to medical treatment following events of July 9th. Personal effects held in the storage locker. Ooh, maybe I can get my gun back. Patient remains in weak coma state. Will respond to stimuli, but only for brief periods of time. When last roused, he reported no memory of recent events. Had trouble re recalling even his own name. Most likely due to severity of initial head trauma. Will continue to monitor. If status does not improve in a week's time, recommend transfer to St. Etienne's? Etne? Etne? Maybe it's Etne. For neurological test. Signed, Dr. Jasinski. Hmm. Very nice, very nice. Oh, I'm loving this already. Like I said, when I played Soma, it absolutely terrified me. And it was so hard to get all the way through it. But man, it was so worth it in the end. I'm hoping this is going to turn out to be another one. I've heard it's a good game. I've heard it's pretty good. Ooh, can I? Sweet. Use the mouse while holding... So, oh, yeah. I was already doing that. Oh, and they're all empty. What a bust. Can I hit keys? Take the pencil with me. Anybody want to send some SOS? Okay. Oh, wasn't hard enough. Mmm. Nothing. I'm beginning to think that the uh, medical boxes was a big sham. Because ain't nothing in none of them. What's that say? First field dressing. Oh. Seems like that would be important to have. Unfortunately, I can't. Can't take it in my inventory. Okay. Need to find the locker. Oh, we got a hole right there. I remember seeing a little hole in the... Uh... I'm assuming that was a rat. I remember seeing a little hole, hole in the, the loading screen. Sick room. Okay, this hasn't been too bad so far. I'm armed with a pair of... Scissor-like tools. Ain't nobody here, though. That makes me nervous. I'd feel a lot better if I had any kind of cloth on me. Hello? <laughs> that didn't quite sound human. We'll see. Let me get here. F to bring up a flash. Oh, I got a flashlight? What? Hold down F to charge the flashlight, but be careful not to make too much noise. What? Oh, so he'll just keep doing that. Okay. How long does it last? <laughs> not very long at all, is it? Now, does it... Does it keep its... Like, if I put it away while it's charged and I bring it out... Okay, it does keep what charge it had. Okay, good. That's what I was wanting to know. 
9th of July, 1700 hours. I'm in a state of agony. It cripples my body, captures my mind, bleeds my soul. This thing I've done, this thing, this thing. It is lunch in the mess hall currently. Oh, the thought of eating repulses me. Wait a second. You know what? I think I do want this sorted by date. Because that was before. When this said... Following event, events from July 9th. I assumed it was the explosion that we were a part of. What's he talking about here? Things I've done. I don't remember what the date was that it showed like when we first booted up the game. I'm almost certain there was a date that showed on the screen. I forgot if this is like before or after. I don't know. We'll figure it out. Oh, hello. I'm sorry. I bumped the broom. I It was an accident. Oh. I wonder if I can find something to cut that open. Can I open you? No. Oh, I can, grab, I can grab the package. Let's try this again. Maybe there's something nice inside. Nope. Nope. Okay. Are those coins? Oh, I thought those were coins there for a minute. Not that I think there's any kind of a shop or anything in here, but... Oh, it died on me. I'm assuming, like, four of those pools. Maybe it's three pools that take it all the way full. Put you away. Oh, ho, ho. All photos that you pick up can be found in the photo tab. Uh, did he melt? Or is he in the ground? The fact that he's standing up so high behind him makes me think this is just like the top quarter of a person. Ooh. Thing in these drawers. Aha. Uh -huh. Found something. July 14th. Body of Sergeant Renard. Multiple lacerations. Chest cavity torn to shreds. Every rib cracked. Skull cracked open by repeated blunt force trauma. Who could have done this to him? I don't know, but that's quite a bit later in our lineup there. Yeah, I think I, I definitely like sorting that by date instead of by author. At least as the default. Is this open? Oh, great. It does not hold its charge like I thought it would. What? Fuel. Petrol. Highly flammable for use in the generator. Can be poured in empty bottles or on the ground. Okay, well, I'll put that as spot number two. Because if I get grenades back, I'll put it as one. Otherwise, I'll totally get myself messed up. Yo, this thing got torched. Oh. I don't see anything else in here to collect. We shall close that. I'll put you away. Actually, let's go ahead and charge you up because I'm just about to step back out here. Oh. That's got a lock on it. Yo, we can actually see down there though. That's kind of cool. 
creepy hole. Don't look like it. Uh, let's go this way first. I like the lights. Man, there are holes all over this place. Okay, we have lights for some of it, but not all of it. Okay. Oh. Oh, I see more petrol. Okay, I guess, I guess this is the mess hall. Oh, and I see blood right there. Hmm, can't read it. Oh, what's inside here? Was the last one. We're trapped down here. The red fucking officers ran and blew the exit behind them. You want to escape? You need to blow it back open. There's dynamite in the arsenal. Ah, and a handle to trigger it somewhere in the excavation site. Get them, and you can make it out. Shit. I think it's coming for me. Here, take this. Finish what? me off. Please. I want to die at the hands of a broader soldier, not that monster. There's ammo in the pantry. Get it. Do the job, please. What? Oh my gosh. That scared the crap out of me. Let's meet. Better you do it than that. that the game doesn't pause when I bring this up, and though, does it? Expired meat should not be consumed by soldiers. Better used to attract rodents and other bunker pests. Can be thrown. You'll need it. Okay. Being brave. Being brave. Open. Thank you. Any around the corners? I want every bullet I can get my hand on. Oh man. Why do I feel like he's gonna get taken before I can even get there? Do I need to shoot him from here? Oh! I had a feeling, but I thought it would be something that, like, if I shot him from here, I could pull it off, but if I got close, he was going to get snagged. Sorry, buddy. I was going to try to do it. Oh, look, he can do that with the gun in the hand. That's amazing. Now, did I get in... This doesn't give me, like, a list of instructions anywhere. Oh. I have to remember what he told me to do. Apparently I'm trying to blow open some kind of a... spot that's been blocked. Uh, dang, he sure did get snagged out of here, didn't he? Well, at least we're not hearing him be, like, tortured or anything in there. Yep. Well, great. That definitely shows me I gotta be watching out of these holes because there's 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 stuff in the holes. Oh, I thought that was cloth I could pick up there for a minute. Uh, you want something else to eat? This is crazy. Super creepy already. Okay. Where am I going? It's like I don't even get near those holes. Uh, I wonder if I could shoot that lock off. 
Would it be worth it? Try. You know what? I feel like I need. Oh, crap. I was all confident about trying here for a minute. We're going to try it. I'm sitting in complete darkness. Oh, I'm in trouble. I was pretty happy at work, though. I did manage to get it open. I don't know if that's where I need to go, though. Because I haven't gone down that way yet. There a name? There's no name up here. Tell me what's down this way. I'm really curious though. Administration. Look at. Oh, I can't like add it to my inventory. No, no, no. I want that back. Well, it's a pencil. Can't do anything with a pencil. Oh, there's a red room up there. I got so many directions to go. Found the administrator's office. Hey, hey, hey I got my first achievement. Could there be an achievement for scared the crap out of yourself? Because that's kind of what I did. <laughs> Oh, what have we here? The... How do you pronounce that? Ba Batiste? Batiste? Hmm. Oh, whoops. I wanted to... Okay, so it's like just a dog tag. Okay. What have we here? Important. When processing deceased soldiers, please check the reverse side of their dog... ID tags or any messages, symbols, or locker codes. I like that. These are to be wiped clean before the tag is preserved and recorded. Well, I don't like that. I don't want them wiped clean. All right. Ooh, can I light this? You can save your progress by lighting this lamp. Ah! <laughs> I heard a growl as soon as I did that. I was like, all happy, and then instantly regret. Oh, look, we're going to need a code to get through here. We got soldiers' quarters, arsenal, officers' quarters. Oh, I hear something breathing. You guys hear that? It's not in here, is it? Or is that me? Am I breathing? Maybe that's me breathing. Use this box for storing things for your inventory. Oh, nice. I can definitely put that in there. I don't need two on me at the moment. I guess I'll stick that in there for the moment, too, because I don't know exactly how to use it. But if I don't keep it on me, I won't even have the option to use it. So maybe, maybe I'll keep that on me for now. Got quite a bit of storage in here, though. I do see a lot of extra space. I wonder if I'll find things that allow me to expand my inventory. I really hope I do. Well, those are two great discoveries. Ooh, we do have a map. This is the map, main map of the bunker. It will be updated with objectives and details. Oh, nice. Very good. So that's where I'm at. The pin, I assume, is where I'm at. We got the medical storage. Sick room is where we started. We came out. Okay, so what's all the way down that other hall that I didn't go down yet? Wine cellar. Oh!
Why? Why? Why was there an explosion all of a sudden? Oh. That was so rude. I had a great time just looking at my little map. Gosh. My whole skin is just crawling at the moment. <laughs> it's so mean. All right. So if we go down that other way, there's a lounge. Blanchet? What's a Blanchet? A Joel, Joel Beat? Strategic Operations. Okay, so there's a lot of rooms over there, and maybe I will find a um, code or something over there. Okay, so the generator room is right in front of me. I wonder if I can activate the generator and get, like, power turned on through the place. Okay, let's see what's on the other side of this. I'm hearing music. I'm shutting you. I'm assuming the music is supposed to be a way for me to know if anything is trying to come after me. Or get close, maybe. Oh. Oh, come on. Not fair. Okay. Rats and burnt corpses. Update to all medical and mortuary personnel. The rat problem has not gotten any better. They're swarming every dead body. They're even coming after the wounded. But the vermin have no interest in flesh after it is burnt. That's why all those bodies were destroyed. So, a new policy must be instituted. The bodies of all deceased soldiers must be burned. I have spoken to Father D. Reyes about this matter. He will provide proper consecration for the deceased. Remains will be preserved for families. This is not ideal, and it fills my soul with pain, but burning the rats seem to be the only way to stop the rats from coming, so burn them we must. So that was like some giant rat that grabbed him, I guess? Because you saw the hand... <laughs> Sorry about that. I saw the hand that grabbed it and pulled it back. I didn't get a very good look at it, but that was a big hand. But part of me is like, why wouldn't you use the dead bodies to try to help set yourself free? You know, if you could use that to lure them. Because if you burn all the dead bodies so that the rats stop going after them, then that means only you and the living bodies are left for the rats to go after. I feel like the smart move would have been to, like, set traps and use the dead bodies for a purpose, you know? Hmm. I wonder if I could turn this thing on. It almost looks like I could turn it on. Got a musical record here. Uh, oh, nope. I wanted to see the back of it. Pick it back up. Bring it in close. That T for rotate is kind of... That's an awkward key to have to hold for that. Got some Bibles. Yep. I keep wanting to use the right mouse button to rotate. Okay, well, I'm not seeing anything else in here to interact with. Okay. Let's go check the generator room, shall we? It's like I find myself trying to look in there before I go in there. There's a little window. Oh, there's another soldier, and he's in front of a hole. Great. Keep on all times. You can power the generator by filling it with fuel and pulling the lever. Oh! Nice. Another compass? Pocket watch. Oh, a pocket watch with stopwatch functionality. Can be synced with the generator to time 
How much fuel remains? Oh, nice. Uh, we're going to stick that as four. Right now it shows zero. Oh, nice. And they even give me some fuel to start with. I appreciate that. Is this going to be like... I feel it. Oh, there's not a hole behind him. Okay. I thought he was going to get snagged there for a minute. Okay. 76.12. Now... Oh, okay. So there is a code tab. Oh, thank goodness. Yo, I'm finding all kinds of goodies now. First aid. For use in wounded on battlefield, proper use can leave even the most wounded soldier feeling their best. I'm nervous about putting that on a hot bar. I'm not going to for the moment. Can I pick up the little bandage thing right there? Looks like he tried to patch himself up. Okay, well before I turn that thing on, I want to see what else might be in here. Because that might activate something. Order to all men. The beast hunts in the dark. The light is our only chance and the generator our only hope. It must be kept fueled at all times, day and night. A continuous rotation of runs to the main fuel supply must be maintained. Watch each other's backs. Keep each other safe. Do not let the light go out for all our sakes. Oh! Oh! Gosh! I mean, if they had regular shifts running trying to keep it lit, what chance do I have by myself running around here at keeping that thing lit? So does that mean I can, like, fight off a rat with this little thing I got right here? Oh, that one wasn't as bad. I got a feeling that's just going to happen from time to time randomly, and I'm going to probably jump almost every time. Lovely. Warning, generator fuel is extremely flammable. Do not light any fires near the fuel. Do not fire any weapons near the fuel. For God's sake, do not even smoke your cigarettes near it. Store it only in sturdy metal canisters. Glass breaks far too easily. If it spills, wipe the area clean immediately, then dispose of the rags outside of the bunker. Like, why did they even stay in the bunker? If they have the option to get out of the bunker and get away, unless maybe there's still the war going on out there. Maybe there's still the war going on and this was the only way they could stay safe. <laughs> well, I don't know. It doesn't sound like it was very safe in here. Okay. Still, still going strong at the moment. Feel, feeling good. Okay. This is the part I'm most nervous about, though. Hmm. I'm out of room in my inventory. Can I just... Oh, let's just use this. Okay, hold, ready, and then to use. Will you pour it in there? That's it? That sure didn't give me much. That gave me one notch. Is that 12 minutes? Yeah, 12 minutes is actually more than I was expecting. Okay. Put you away. I don't want to hear you ticking the whole time. Man, now I feel like I gotta move with a bit of urgency. I got what? Two bullets at the moment? There's no, no light up here, though. Where'd my light go? Do I have to relight it? Oh, nice. Okay, so it goes after out after a bit, and then I can relight it. All right, let's see if that code was for this. What was it? Uh, 7612. Okay. 
seven, six, uh, twelve. Hey, what do you know? I'll put that away for the moment. Since we have, you can overcome most obstacles in multiple ways. Use your wits and your brain's experiment. If you think something might be possible, do it. It possible. It probably is. Oh, that is so cool. Like shooting the lock off of there. If you think it might be possible, it probably is. I like that they say that. Uh, oh, is this why I couldn't open that? Wait. Infirmary. It was blocked off. Oh, if I went around that way, it wouldn't have worked. What does this do? Oh, it's for the lights. Does my fuel last longer if I have less things running? Oh, my goodness. I'm down to five minutes already? That's clearly not using normal time. <laughs> no way it's been seven minutes since I powered that bad boy up. Okay. What was that? It was like some knocking noise. Turn the lights on. Very nice. There's a sign up here. Exit! <laughs> yeah, let's go that way. I like the sign of exit. I don't know which way I should go. It says exit is this way, everything else is that way. Let's go take a look at the exit. I know he said that they they shut it. Oh, this one's not. Okay. Have not seen another human for hours now. I might be the last, but in the hope that there might be another, I leave this now so you do not waste any time. This is the only exit. The only way out of this hell of our own making. It will be blown closed. It needs to be blown open. Don't bother digging. Impossible. Blow it up. The dynamite is locked in the arsenal. Oh, thank goodness. It's recapping what I need to do. The detonator handle is somewhere down in the remain tunnels. Deeper in hell. <laughs> I go now to try to retrieve them both, though I do not know if you exist. I pray for you. Please extend me the same courtesy. Whew. You found a new objective. Objectives will be marked on your map and notes containing objectives will be highlighted in the notes. Oh, so grateful for that. Oh crap. I at least got to see. Yo, it does look like it, right there is freedom. But it sounds like there's like machinery or something going on. Great. There it went. I want to check this room real quick. Take a look at my map. Mm. <laughs> Exit. My ultimate goal. Okay, so we need to be getting to the arsenal. So if I go out the door, I just went into turn left. That's the direction I need to go. Okay. Yo. Very nice. Progress saved. Oh, nice. So even if it's already lit, I can redo it. Where are we at? Oh my goodness, it's been an hour already. All right, we'll go a bit further here. I'm going to play a couple more hours of this tonight, so I, uh, I'm trying to pace myself. I need to go that way. I'm not going to pour another thing of fuel in there just yet. I feel like that first one went really fast. Oh, you know what I should do, though? My inventory is like full. Let's go back. Man, that's noisy when I run. Oh, okay. So I'm going to stick this in there for now. And I guess the mm, pocket watch for now. I'll pull that stuff out. I kind of feel like a generator running might be far more useful for like 
if there's some objectives I'm trying to accomplish and I gotta make a bunch of runs somewhere, that's when I might wanna have the generator running. Cause I didn't make it hardly anywhere while that was running just now. But I say that now, but I'm not being chased by creatures. It might be later where I'm like, screw it, I'm keeping that generator running every moment I have fuel. We'll have to wait and see. And this I'm gonna keep on me still for the moment. Can be thrown. Should I? Let's put this on a hotkey. Oh, it's like a heart. <laughs> All right. Whew, okay, here we go, y'all. Look how dark that is. I got steps or a ramp. Okay, here. That's not the direction I need to go. I need to go that way. Or something. Did you see the ceiling had dust that was like. How am I supposed to move around? Do I have to crouch walk? That was terrifying. Go this way. Don't you grab me. I can't go in there. Oh, I'm terrified. Can I? It says emergency lockdown. I somehow need to lift that first. There is something nearby. I can hear it. want to move. Suddenly the generator running starting to sound a lot more enticing. Oh, there's quarters. All right, we're going for it. Might regret this. Shut the door. Oh, and you can lock them. Ooh, what's this? Empty bottle. Oh yeah, we're supposed to be able to pour that gasoline into that, aren't we? This is so terrifying. Oh boy. That's a big rat. It's a really big rat. Can I turn you on? Oh, the generator has to be running for you to... That sucks. Okay. To anyone who finds this, Bountier, our commanding officer, cowers next to me now. He's lost his mind to an abyss of fear. He repeats the same refrain over and over. Flee, flee. We must flee and seal the beast where it belongs. He wants to run, to blow up the exit behind him, sealing the demon down here. The demon and our men. His constant refrain is getting to me, and that same void of terror, it is also overtaking me. To any of my men who see this, once we're free of this place, I will get the arsenal code from him. I will get it, and I will radio it back to you. Trapped down here with that beast, the arsenal may be your only hope. It's all I can do, all I have courage to do. 
get to the communications room in the soldiers' quarter, hide there. I'll oh, okay. I'll broadcast the code to you. That's the first one I've seen that goes down. Okay. Oh, got another one. Uh, night. Strange scratching sounds a few moments ago, and now it sounds like someone is pacing in the hallway. Probably Renard. Drunk on the stash of wine, I know he hides from us. Best I confront him now, either get him into bed to sleep it off, or convince him to share a bottle or two with me. <laughs> Very nice. Okay, so this is the next night. Cold fear runs through all our veins now. Foreigner has terrorized the men for answers. They say they were asleep until Renard screams. I believe him, of course. Foreigner went so far as to accuse prisoner 7314, 73014 of escaping his cell and committing the murder. Impossible. I worry about Foreigner. His rage hides fear. He takes it out on the men and I see no way to stop it. It breeds contempt. My mind slips back to the moment Renard started screaming. How easily it could have been me. How easily it still could be. For the first time, I wish the order to attack would come. I would rather face a thousand German guns than this nameless dread. Ooh. That is terrifying. So it sounds like it arrived on the 15th. Or at least it started attacking these guys on the 15th. I'm scared to go out this door. I know I thought something was pacing out there as well. Gosh. Oh. You stupid bombs. Okay. Uh, strategic operations. That looked like it was kind of a bigger room. Oh. Oh my gosh. Was the room booby trapped? Uh, days of hell. I tripped a wire and thought for sure I was dead, but it was only a sound trap. I was lucky, but then the Germans came running. I think that, that door was booby trapped. Oh man. <laughs> That scared me. So I guess that little click sound was supposed to be my warning to back up. And then I heard that creature roar too. So I don't know if like... Uh, oh, I don't know if, if I would have taken off running. I like that I can lock these doors. That's right. I'm locking both of them. So yeah, I don't know if it was... Uh, even if I took off running to escape that, if I then would have been chased by the creature, I don't know. Uh, that's where we're going to end this episode. We'll go out, record my next intro, get right back in here, and we're going to continue to work our way back through there. I'm assuming I'm going to have to re-get those notes from out of there. Not the end of the world if I do. Yeah, I can see my photos not here anymore. Okay. So I'll head right back to that room first. We'll get that stuff. I'm going to try to see if I can get into that room. I'm going to look around a little bit first, see if there's a way I can, like, disarm it. Maybe there's a trick to disarming that thing. Um, I'm loving this game, and I'm so terrified. I am i haven't played anything as scary as Soma since Soma. And I've even played some games like Alien Isolation was really good, but it was not on the same level of terror. It's different when you can fight back when you feel like you can defend yourself. In this, I have a gun, but I, I'm terrified to even use the gun. Because my thought is, I got two bullets, and I don't know if it's even gonna stop the thing. Who knows, maybe it's used more for like, getting past puzzles and stuff, more than you're supposed to use it to try to defend yourself. Maybe you'll regret that. I don't know, but I'm totally loving the atmosphere of this. <sighs> I'm gonna get another episode in tonight. I can do two. I could get two episodes, especially since I haven't necessarily seen a creature yet. I'm not too terrified yet, but we'll have to wait and see what happens on the next episode. Until next time, continue to be safe out there, everybody. I'll see you on the next one.